My mother-in-law is a terrible driver. Want to see just how terrible? All right, grab some popcorn, sit down, and try to cringe as much as possible. Let's dive right into it. My mother-in-law wants to turn up here, and she goes into the oncoming turn lane on the wrong side of the street. But that's just the beginning of the face palms. There's a semi-truck next to her in the right turn only lane, but when the light goes green, she's afraid to go because of the semi-truck that's at zero risk of hitting her. Where'd the tr go? The truck is turning. A few minutes later, in true hypocrite fashion, she gets mad at a driver that barely hesitated for not going even faster on the green light. Come on, go! <sighs> My wife decided not to scold her mother. Oh, this fucking car in front of me. You were doing that. But things get even more ridiculous. My mother-in-law wants to turn right, but is scared to get into the right turn lane next to this thing. She thinks he might turn right from the straight lane, despite no indication that he will. This Dan's gonna hit my car. I'm not gonna get near it. No, you could go on that lane. No, I won't. Well, I won't. Okay. If it turns and goes, hits me. He's not turning. He's going straight. I don't trust him. Now, she won't get all the way into the turn lane because she's scared she'll hit the curb. Oh, but there's more. Left turns yield to straight traffic, hence no arrow. In this situation, you're supposed to get out into the intersection while you wait for an opening. She doesn't, and she misses her first opportunity, granted maybe a narrow opportunity, and then she misses her second chance. Oh, you could have gone. Now she wants to make a right turn, but once again won't proceed down the right turn only lane. This time it's because she thinks her car won't fit, which it clearly can. She has sufficient space. I'm not, I can't get through that. I, you just let me drive like I drive. Oh. You're fine. Hit the curb. You're fine. And once again, she gets mad because she thinks the traffic is sitting at the green light, which they aren't. Nice the light is green, why do these cars wait? But we're not done. She goes to turn right and fails to stay in her lane. And here she had to be reminded of the Range Rover backing up to park. Right. Watch out, watch out. She wanted to turn right at this intersection, but for some reason, she thinks it's a one-way street from right to left. Well, I can't go right. I will go straight, it's a one-way. She missed all the clues that she can turn right. The arrow on the pavement, no signs prohibiting right turns, no one-way sign, the yellow line separating lanes of opposing traffic, and a car over here facing the direction she wanted to turn. That's five clues. How blind can someone be? Now she can't figure out where the straight lane is, despite the sign and pavement markings. The straight lane is over there. The straight lane's up behind that car. That's the straight lane. Go to the straight lane. I gotta turn? No, you gotta go straight from the straight lane. Get behind that car. Well, there's a turn there. Oh, I see. No, you gotta go straight from oh, this I lane. See. I see. It's okay. I'm not used to runs like this. Except, these lane configurations are extremely common. Now she gets confused by this green light, with an arrow directing drivers to remain going straight in this lane. While not extremely common, there's nothing inherently confusing about it. Why are you stopping? Oh, it's green. It's okay. It's up, but how come it's not means that way? It's not round. I don't know. Do you have a headache yet? Are you cringing hard enough? Because this nightmare is not over yet, folks. She's turning right, but at a snail's pace and keeps driving like a snail on Xanax. This is truly painful, but it gets worse. You can clearly see this car about to come her way. Oh, look at that car getting out. The proper thing to do is to pull to the right and wait for that driver to go by, then proceed. But she doesn't. Where is he going to go? How are you going to do that? You just trapped him. Well, he could just wait for me. Yeah, that's a great attitude. She's turning right once again, and anyone with eyes can see this speed bump. Can you see it? Good, I thought so. But when she goes over it... 
On the highway, so you I went over the curb. No, you didn't. You went over a speed bump. Oh. Yes, she actually thought she hit a curb and didn't even know about the speed bump. Wow. And now she runs the metering light, which hasn't turned green for her yet. Okay, the nightmare is almost over. Let's see what she does next. She finishes this compilation by cutting this driver off. After all that, you probably don't even remember eating your popcorn. All right, guys, there's a lot more exciting content to come. So be sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon, drop a comment below, give us a thumbs up and share. Also, check out some of our other videos. Thank you for watching.